Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty and today is a video on my finished artwork. Um, I have some new and some old, some you guys have already seen videos on, some I don't, not sure if I made videos or uh, some videos have not been posted yet. So um, I have a few so I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, a couple that's been resined, but, okay, so I'm going to start off with my two little framed ones that I would poured on glass. And these I had a hard time getting to focus, but maybe it'll, there you go. So here's this one. Just poured it and I did varnish it. Just in a little frame. Thought I'd give it give it a try. I've seen uh, Sherry um, from Sherry's Life pour on glass all the time, and she inspired me to do it. So here's another one. This one I I poured on, and then I dragged a fork through it, a plastic fork. So that one's kind of cool. All right, let's set these over here, and then. I have, i done this a while ago with uh, my purple tree ring, I think you guys had already seen it, go that way, but I ended up with this silver right there, I kind of see a, I don't know, bird, like here's the beak, you know, and here's the eye, I don't know, so here's this one. And, um, sorry, if anybody's interested in anything, just, I'll put my email below and just let me know because everything is for sale. Here's one that I did a long time ago. I'm not sure if there's a video, but it's purple, black, and gold, I think. Oh, there's that one. Sorry, still got that cough. Here's a gold one that I did, gold and white. I think I did like three of these different techniques. But I tell you, that gold really, really shines. I love using gold. So there's that one. And they're soft. <laughs> All right. Have these in boxes so just trying to put them back in there as I go all right so here's one that I did I think crimson with crimson black and white so this one came out pretty cool I love the I don't remember if I used silicone or not on this but this one came out really pretty so there's that one and then here's another one. I think this was, uh, oh, I don't remember the color. Maybe rose. I don't know what color that, I think maybe a rose gold, but this one came out pretty cool. Try to get a little, see a little bit of it. that one. Alright. Here is I think it'll fall. Here is a green and gold one that I had done some time ago. And see that, that gold and it's so soft. That gold just really, really comes out. It's awesome. But here's this one. I'm gonna try not to spend too much time on each video. I mean, on each uh, painting, because 
I don't want the video to be too long and y'all get bored, you know. So there's this one. And then here is one that I tried with Earth Tones. I did another one, um, but it's actually all packed up in a box. The other one's in my Etsy store. But here's this one. That one. And then here's another gold one that I've done. I think the video for this is already out. I'm not sure. But here's this one. That gold. So pretty. I don't... It's that one. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember what I was trying for here, but <laughs> but here's this. It'll focus. That would be great. There you go. It's this one, the green. I think it's earth green, cad yellow, and gold. I was on those colors for a lot, a long time. They just came out so cool together. I love this one. Little focus. There it goes. All that lacing and stuff. It's very cool. It's three little Dutch pores. My daughter says they look like uh, uh, leaves of lettuce. Okay. So, put these in this box real quick and we'll get you some more. Okay, so those were older. Um, here's some newer ones. And these I actually just finished uh, varnishing. Um, so this one, I don't, the video's not out yet. I haven't posted it yet, but here's this one. This was uh, the first time um, I had tried, well, no, because I think I did on other ones, but I was trying the golden pouring medium. Come on. I don't know if it's going to focus. Come on. It's really super shiny. There it goes. Now I can't move. So I, I tried the golden, and it is so, like, I didn't even know if I should varnish it because it's so super soft and shiny. But that's really pretty cool. And I really don't remember the colors. Clearly it's like red and green. Oh, it was red, blue, yellow, and green. That's what I did. But check out those cells. It's very, very, very cool. Very soft. It's very soft. You can see it's really shiny. Alright, so there's that one. And then here's another one I had done. Um, same thing using the golden, golden pouring medium. And they're so soft. Like, I don't know what it is, but geez. I do it all day, y'all. So cool. Here's this one. Super shiny. And then. <clears throat> I think this was an older canvas that I had just poured, I had to do something with, so this one's got uh, purple and I think uh, the flash, the pink flash, or no, pink, uh, what is that called? The, is it flash? The one that changes colors? You guys know what I'm talking about. And that's this one right here, I think. But I was trying to get... I had a bunch of that paint left, so. Alright. This little guy. 
did the fork thing with. These still have tape on them and stuff, so. But I'll be peeling that off here soon. He's kind of cool. Little guy. Here's another one with the same colors. This is a floating cup. I, I was doing these colors because I did it for a, somebody um, as a commission piece, but they're over there. So this one is super cool if I can get it up there. I, I really like this one. And it's got like gold and silver, black, white. And is that copper, I think? But this one came out super cool. I love this one. All varnish, just need to peel off the tape. Oh, this is my first time using a linen canvas, too. Okay, we're almost done. So here's another. It was on another um, color spree that I was, I was on. So this was, uh, it's the purple, is that the purple flash and the pink flash? You know the ones that change colors, so it's purple and then it goes blue. And then the pink. So this was another, um, floating cup. I just love. I got this up close earlier, just to see how it look on camera but I just love this one you can see the it's cool I love this one too I love the lacing in it when you do the the floating cup okay let's do these first Okay, so these are, uh, I think, six by sixes. So I was trying to do a, like what I would do with my, my tiles. Um, and did the Dutch pour. So this, I, don't, I was going to scrape him off. It wasn't a drip, but I don't think. But I just decided to leave him. This is the, there's gold and, of course, blues. Um... Yeah, they still got the tape, but I like them. So there's one of them. These are all varnished. Just need to peel all the tape off. And there's this one. Oh, it was Payne's Gray. That's what it was. Payne's Gray... I don't know, blue and white. I think there's a video, but I haven't I just haven't posted it yet. So there's those. And then Alright. Jeez. Alright, so these are resin these last I think I've only got three left. So these last three are resin, and it was on, um, I was doing the same colors as that other big one. I wish I could remember, the pink flash, I know it's called flash. Anyway, so, there's this one, I hope I can get close enough, where you can, I don't know where it is. Anyway, it, you can see the blue in it, like, over in here. So it must have been the purple flash, or something, but... This one's super, super pretty. Maybe I can... Oh no, that one's really pretty. So this one's resin and it's on the... What is it? MDF board? And then... I did these two little guys. I'll show you this one. I'll show you this one first. I just did little Dutch pours. So you can see the blue in this one really good. So 
this. I like I like these ones. These ones came out really pretty. So these are on the little boards too. And it was I used um, dioxazine purple as for the base, for the background. And then I did the pink flash, and I think um, white, metallic white. I think. So you can see it all up in here. So pretty. I love these. These ones came out really, really pretty. Oh yeah, that's a good one. You can really see it there. But yeah. So that is it for this one, for this video, you guys. I do have more. <laughs> um, but I didn't want to show you all of them all at once because I have so many. But that is it for this one. Um, I still have coasters and just framed artwork and just more paintings so uh, a lot more resin resin paintings so um, but that's it for this one you guys and um, so look forward for the next one that I post and I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you all so much for watching if you have not subscribed please do so don't forget to hit that like button if you like this video and hit that bell so you'll be notified when I upload my next video um, leave me comments and let me know what you guys think. And like I said, I'll put my email below and, um, so if anybody's interested or you just want, you have a question or anything, um, just shoot me an email. So, that's it you guys. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you on the next one. Bye!